as many of you guys know, APs are coming up now, and I am honestly stressing, like, that's why I need my coffee, so that I can stay up late and grunt until I know my material in these books. Just these three. Like, it's not that bad, honestly. I know many people had it worse. So this year, I'm just taking like two APs, which isn't actually that many. Um, I'm just taking AP Physics 1 and AP Comp Sci. My teachers this year are pretty good. My Comp Sci teacher is pretty chill. My Physics teacher is also pretty chill. It just gives us literally like the hardest questions possible on the tests and then just makes the lab super easy. I don't know where he's got that thinking, but whatever makes his blow flow, right? So right now it is like Saturday, April 15th and the AP exams are on the 3rd and the 11th for me in May. So I do have some time. I've started studying for them like two weeks ago. Uh, mainly started studying first with the physics and then just started studying comp sci like last week i'd say more so this week though and i'd say it's going pretty good so tonight i just have a lot of things to be done oh i'm just trying to remember okay so i need to do a unit of physics to review and then maybe some mcqs um, and then I want to finish a unit from the AP Comp Sci book because I just started on this book. I pretty much finished reviewing all of these. I've only reviewed a couple of these units. Um, oh yeah, I took the, I'm taking the courses for these, so it's not like I'm totally out of the know, which is good. So, so I should probably stop rambling on and actually get some work done. So I'll come back to you in like... 30 minutes or so during my brain break. Okay, this may sound weird to you guys, like if you guys are taking comp sci or physics or have taken them. Honestly, sometimes physics just feels easier, although it should be the other way around. Like, sure I made a careless error in there for these questions. But I'm honestly feeling a bit of confusion, which is not good. Yeah, mainly confusion, honestly, but hopefully it gets better. Anyways, I do not want a migraine, so I think it's good. If I go ahead and eat some dinner now, dinner can be a bit of a break, then hopefully I can do a bit of review for this comp size stuff that I just learned in about a day, and then probably do some physics. Uh, but I think some dinner first might be good, so let's get going. Anyways, don't mind me, but my bed is really made at the moment. Uh, but one of my best studying techniques, which may be weird. Is that when I study, I actually chuck my phone like right here so that I never get distracted because I'm a lazy guy. So it's not like I want to get out of my comfy studying chair and go all the way to the bed to get my phone where I know I just get hella distracted. So that's why I just leave it on the bed and it honestly really helps with studying. So I think it's a good tactic uh, for you guys. Try hiding your phone if you keep on losing focus, it works. Or at least put it, put it at a safe distance. I feel it's a good strategy. Dinner time. Still some light out, which is actually pretty sweet. My parents are out getting dinner. Like probably every other Asian parent, they leave me behind because they want me to study. And I think it's a good decision. I do need studying, so it's nice. Anyways, I laid out my lunch beforehand so that, oh sorry, what am I saying? Dinner, it's already dinner. Um, just some blueberries and 
this. <sighs> so that I don't have to make it later. I honestly think I need to invest in like a wider type of lens for my camera so that I don't need to bend down to get in the video. Like, uh, honestly, should I get a new camera? Like, okay, yeah, my channel may look like it has like what, like three subscribers, but I actually have another channel that's, I think like, I need to check how many subscribers it has. 992 as of now, if you want to check. I'm just gonna start eating because I'm hungry. Okay, so now I'm done, so I think I'm just gonna go outside for a bit before it gets dark. Let me just show you guys what it's looking like. As you can see, it's almost dark, but like it's not dark yet. So I'm gonna try to play a bit of hockey before the sun fully sets. Let me just check when the sun sets. Shoot. Okay, so it's actually gonna rain soon, so that's not good. Um, so I definitely wanna get out soon. Uh, the sun sets in seven minutes, so I should probably get going. So <laughs> let's go. Okay, so bad news, guys. It is raining, as you can see. But uh, good news is that it's not raining that much. So it's only drizzling. Hopefully nothing gets on the lens. I'll put this undercover. Uh, but yeah, it is a bit windy, so hopefully the muffler does a good job. Um, Here's my net, not much going on, just a net and a stick. This is the stick I use if you play hockey. Uh, yeah, not much to see, just a stick. That was fun. Uh, I wouldn't really call it exercise, but at least it was fun. Good to get some time outside right now. You know, when you're studying, it's always nice to give your mind a break. And when I say break, I don't mean like go on your phone and scroll on social media for 30 minutes. I more like mean go outside, take a bit of a breather, you know, give yourself a bit of a workout, get your heart pumping and that's really how I feel you get more energy to actually do more work, which is why I went outside because I realized that going outside for like a short amount of time just is infinitely better than just scrolling on your phone for like 30 minutes as a break. I feel you really reset your mind once you go outside. <coughs> <coughs> what just happened there? Anyways, what I was about to say is that you really reset your mind once you go outside and I think that's just really beneficial. So, it's time to get back to studying. Time update, it's currently 8.16, so I have some time to do more work. I usually go to bed at around 11 or 12, so depends on how productive I am. I think I'm just gonna do some physics review and then I'm gonna try some practice questions and then maybe take a shower, then do another work period, then hit the sack. So let's get going. Anyways guys, I am pretty much done. So it's now 10.17, so I've been studying for maybe 
two hours ish i did take like a 15 minute break halfway through um i think that's honestly enough work for tonight i'm definitely gonna try to do some editing for this video tonight but i don't know how i record myself editing this video so so anyways guys i'm probably just gonna take a shower now and then hit the bed, do some editing, you know, the usual. So anyways, I think that's pretty much it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, I'll see you guys in the next one. See ya.